I recently had a chance to take NetSuite for a test drive during a live demo. Might not be perfect for every company, but it shines in some key areas, accounting and supply chain management especially. Stick around and we'll figure out if it's the right move for your business. Hey everyone, this is Jeff Budiak with Software Connect, your trusted partner for software reviews, research, and recommendations. We've tested and reviewed various ERP systems extensively. Don't miss our best ERP roundup page for more on that. Check the link below. NetSuite is often hailed as the world's most deployed cloud ERP. Many see it as the first big name in cloud software. Its user base spans over 40,000 organizations across 160 countries. It's a cloud-based ERP system integrating finance, operations, and sales into one platform. NetSuite got its start from a five-minute phone call between its founder, Evan Goldberg, and Oracle's Larry Ellison. With Ellison's funding, NetSuite came to life as NetLedger. It changed its name in 2003 and went public in 2007. Eventually, NetSuite was acquired by Oracle in 2016. Since then, NetSuite's aimed to complement Oracle's existing ERP services, but this has spurred competition with other Oracle products. Users worry about rising costs during contract renewals and fewer low-cost plans. There's also some rumblings about added complexity as the platform integrates new features like AI. Overall, NetSuite is best for small businesses with 10 to 50 employees. It's a step up from QuickBooks and spreadsheets, pulling all your company's data into one place. As an ERP solution, it offers features beyond accounting like project management. It's also good for mid-market companies with 50 to 200 employees. These organizations often have limited budgets, making high-cost ERP solutions impractical. The good news is NetSuite has a cloud-based architecture. This eliminates the need for on-site hardware and expertise. It's not just for small and medium businesses. NetSuite also helps enterprises with over 10,000 employees. Adding new features and users is easy. Plus, it's set up to work globally, handling different currencies, taxes, and languages out of the box. Where NetSuite really stands out is for distributors. It offers real-time inventory tracking and robust planning. But if you're a process manufacturing, you should probably look elsewhere. It lacks specialized modules for recipe management and batch tracking. Our internal reviews show that the median company size considering NetSuite is 30 employees. If you're a startup, NetSuite might be too complex and pricey. In that case, choose a lighter ERP system like Odoo. During in my demo, I found NetSuite had a few key advantages, like its multi-tenant cloud environment. NetSuite uses a mature cloud-native design built for multiple tenants. Each customer gets their own dedicated storage. This design avoids issues often seen in systems transitioning from on-site to cloud, like outdated architecture and technical problems. NetSuite excels in accounting and financial reporting. It automates revenue recognition and streamlines forecasting. Additionally, it supports multi-currency transactions and global operations. Although Sage Intact offers financial management and more business tools, it's not a comprehensive ERP solution like NetSuite. Finally, it offers out-of-the-box functionality. Many of NetSuite's features are ready to use immediately upon installation. No customization required. This stands in contrast to Infor Cloud Suite Industrial. It often demands upfront customization, providing tailored fit at the expense of increased cost, implementation time, and complexity. Ready to explore NetSuite? Before diving into its cons, I want to mention our free software consultations. Our team of software experts can fast-track your search with a quick needs analysis, offering you a tailored list of products or getting you started with NetSuite. Just visit softwareconnect.com or follow the link in the description. Now let's jump into some of the drawbacks of NetSuite. Case in point, it's tedious setup. You'll need technical expertise to set up NetSuite. It also lacks the low-code customization found in systems like Acumatica. However, Oracle offers solutions like Suite Success and NetSuite Connector. These tools simplify implementation and link NetSuite with your e-commerce, point of sale, or logistics solutions. NetSuite does not have specialized equipment and field service management modules. However, systems like SVP Business One include maintenance scheduling and service contracts management. Finally, it has limited heavy manufacturing support. While NetSuite can handle light manufacturing, it falls short in other areas like complex bill of materials. Epicor Kinetic offers a product configurator and advanced planning and scheduling for engineer-to-order operations. While NetSuite doesn't share pricing publicly, I can say we've seen specific packages and quotes. We're not allowed to share those details, but I can talk about their current pricing strategy as of this recording. NetSuite operates on a user base annual licensing model. This includes the core platform, user count, and any additional features. NetSuite offers various package types, including financials-focused, manufacturing, distribution, and more. 
each has a standard and a premium initial package. These packages have a pricing matrix that varies by industry and company size. These tiers are usually broken out by under 10, under 30, and over 30 users. Generally, there's a monthly overall package fee and a $99 monthly fee per user. The absolute minimum pricing is over $1,000 per month. Basic support, which includes online ticketing and user group access, is free for all NetSuite customers. However, toll-free and weekend support are exclusive to the higher cost premium and advanced plans. One-time implementation fees can range from $10,000 to $100,000 dependent upon your specific needs. It's common for businesses to engage NetSuite partners or consultants for this process. As a general rule, implementation is two times your licensing cost. Finally, add-on and implementation fees are separate from license fees. So that's a rough outline of what the pricing might look like. What are some of NetSuite's more notable aspects? Like I mentioned before, NetSuite's accounting module is comprehensive. It covers basics like bringing your general ledger and accounts together, but I think its most distinctive features are its customizable dashboards and KPIs. They provide a clearer picture of profit margins, cash flows, and other real-time financial metrics. NetSuite has a drag-and-drop report builder called Suite Analytics. It comes with 20 pre-built financial report templates. While Sage Intact provides 150, you can customize NetSuite's templates as needed. But creating complex and custom reports requires some coding skills in SuiteScript and SQL. The inventory and order management modules also deserve a mention. NetSuite automates much of your order to cash process. It also updates inventory levels and financial reports as orders come in. Plus, you can manage sales orders, monitor shipping and fulfillment, and reduce your inventory holding costs. A third key feature for NetSuite is supply chain management. You can maintain multiple warehouses and do demand planning. Its wheelhouse also includes vendor management and procurement analytics. These tools help identify cost-effective suppliers and evaluate their performances. Finally, NetSuite can catch early warning signs of supply chain disruptions. Our verdict? NetSuite gets a solid 8.3 out of 10 for its native cloud system, out-of-the-box features, and powerful financial management. Ready to dive into the ERP world? Our Roundup page features titans like Acumatica and Dynamics 365 Business Central. That link is in the description below. Have you ever used NetSuite? What do you think? We want to hear your thoughts in the comments. To learn more about NetSuite or other ERP solutions, tap into our software expertise. Click on the description below or head over to softwareconnect.com. Until next time.